In this video, I'm going to show you how to make a bouncing ball on Photopea. So you're going to open up a new document, and it's going to be 1280 pixels by 720, 72 resolution. The background can just be white. You can find a spherical object, such as a bagel, a donut, a head, anything you want to bounce, or you can draw one. I'm going to just show you simply how to draw one and then make the project. I'm going to create a new layer. I'm going to go over here to the rectangular marquee, click, hold it, and change it to the elliptical select, and make a round circle for my ball. I'm going to come here to the paint bucket. If you see this, this is how you change the gradient tool to the paint bucket. And then it's red, which is fine, and I'm going to paint. Now I have my ball that I want to bounce. I'm going to come over here and I'm going to duplicate the layer. Drag it down a little. Duplicate the layer. Drag it down again. I'm right clicking. Duplicate the layer. And then here at the bottom, I want this one to be a little squished out. So I'm going to go to Edit, Transform, Scale. And I'm going to squish it out and squish it in. And then hit Return. Now I don't want to duplicate this one again unless I want it to start becoming round. Okay, I'll do that. Duplicate the layer. Now I have to make it round again, so I have to go to Edit, Transform, Scale. Start. It doesn't matter if it gets bigger, because it, that'll just make it look like it's coming forward. And let's do one more. Duplicate the layer with the Move tool. I drag it out. I go to Edit, Transform, Scale. And I'll make this one really big. Okay. And that's all you need. I'm going to do Command-D on a Mac, Control-D on a PC to get rid of that selection. Don't worry if these are blurry. I'm not worried about that for this. This is just to learn how to animate. And on Pixlr, it has a built-in programming language. So you do underscore A underscore before each of these layers. You just kind of click until you can change the type. Underscore, little a, underscore. Copy that. Paste. This is telling it to animate. And now that I have them all animated, I go here to File, Export as a GIF. And I can see that it's bouncing. Okay, so I'm not seeing the whole uh, document. You just see a portion of it when you're doing this. So if I want it to move a little slower or faster, I can play around with the speed here. I'll have it a little bit slower. Not that slow. There, like that. Okay. And then once I'm there, I do repeat forever. Zero equals forever. So that's what I want it to say. Save. And then it'll export. It says new project. So I need to change the name. So I will title it Holiday GIF and then I can put it into Google Classroom. So that is how you do it on Photopea.